we have to continue to improve in order for us to be able to be the type of program that one day we want to be. And uh, we need to take this opportunity on Saturday night. Oh, that was Coach Jed Fish as the Wildcats prep for a Mississippi State team who's over a 10 point favorite. How's your energy, Southern Arizona? Good morning to you. I'm Paul C. Collum. The Wildcats have already sold 80% of their seats for the APM Saturday showdown against an SEC opponent, but the fan experience goes beyond the X's and O's on the field. Sometimes a party atmosphere at Arizona Stadium and good old fashioned grub make all the difference. If you have an appetite for football, I'm sure you have an appetite for this. It's the newest upgrades in food at Arizona Stadium. And with a new section on the southeast end, it is time to tempt your tummy with the tantalizing taste of some of the new foods they're unveiling, including buffalo chicken nachos, Sonoran dogs, bear bratwurst, beyond veggie brats, mustard ass pretzels, and Hebrew national dogs. Well, certainly our partners at Aramark have done a great job in uh, enhancing the overall service, food service and beverage service for uh, the fans when they come in. I think they'll like what they see, the speed of service. Remember, we're completely cashless, so bring that credit card, your Apple Pay, your Google Pay, uh, and, you know, again, you can get things really, uh, really quickly. Quickly for beer and drinks, too, as Arizona Athletic Director Dave Heakey pointed out during the Thursday tour that also included a new pop-up store full of merchandise on the southwest end of the stadium. Hey, but back to the good old grub. New amenities across the board on the menu items, so our fans will really like that, I'm sure. You got to sample it yourself. What was your first impression after taking a bite? Boy, I sampled a few things there, but we got the Sonoran dogs, we got the Wisconsin beer brats, uh, the mustache pretzels. Uh, it's excellent, it's good food. Good food and great dessert, Sonoran style, with authentic fruit popsicles added to the menu, or paletas, as we call it here in the old Pueblo. Speaking of, as members of the media, we got to try the new food, and I'll say not too bad, but my personal favorite, no secret, straight from the Sonoran Desert, a Paul Letta. You get it? I'm Paul Paletta. <laughs> bad jokes aside, my friends, not too bad. Oh, yeah, the hunger for a winning season combined with the fan experience also seems to be packing a bigger bite at Arizona Stadium in 2022. Bon Appetit! Oh, the fan game day experience definitely goes beyond the play on the field as the Cats also remain very hungry for a victory against Mississippi State. That's it for now. I'm Paul C. Cutler for News 4 Tucson Sports. Have a positive, productive day filled with lots of joy.